Right outside Eatonville lies Owat Valley. It has recently become a new learning environment over the past year thanks to the Grits Farm. Students from Eatonville High School have the opportunity to earn a science credit in natural resources, a CTE credit in farm management, and a PE credit based on the hours of physical labor and other activities on the farmstead. Todd Morish is the Grits Program Director and has worked together with Alex Van Steen's fourth grade class at Columbia Crest. These two classes have created a collaboration and formed a new and engaging way to learn. Every month, the fourth graders come to visit and showcase what they have learned in the classroom. How do you feel about what you have been studying? I, I feel pretty good about what I've been studying because I didn't really, I loved animals, but I didn't really know how they survived out in the wild with all this cold and we learn like all this like the structures and how the paws have certain things to keep them warm. I really appreciate the Brits farmers because it has given my kids a real purpose in their science. So they're not just learning these facts and making presentations, but they get to give them to real people. And you guys really care about them, and you really do a great job working with them. The coyotes, coyotes have adaptations. They hunt rabbits. They try to get the rabbits to feed their families. But rabbits are very good at freezing, and sometimes they hop in their own tracks to confuse the animal about where they're going. The bunnies have to get food to feed their family, so they're trying to stay away from the coyotes. My uh, favorite job on the farm is probably the trail that we're going. It's going to be a Lahar trail, which means that we can also use it as a escape route for if the volcano erupts. And another favorite job of mine was creating the teepee out here that we can use for our fire lesson and other projects that we do. Well, the, uh, the farm benefits Eatonville in a number of ways. Uh, just the ability to preserve one of the original homesteads uh, in our area. I think it's just a historical benefit right now. It needs a little work to, to get it back up to snuff, but um, I just think for generations uh, to come, they'll be able to come out here and, and just see what life kind of looked like a little bit um, when the first settlers came out in this area. While I've been on the farm, I've learned how to more or less work with a group better and how to kind of respect the environment a lot more um, and to keep working even if there's rain or it's really hot out. Todd Morris's goal for each of the Grits farmers is to leave with a sense of accomplishment and a sense of their future. Also, to find themselves in a place within a community and how each of them can benefit in society.